Hey, what's up guys? It's Ryan here. It's now May 25th, 2017. Planning on doing an awesome hike today. Do a couple of test pans when I get down there too. All right guys, see you down there. Thanks for coming back. Looks like we had enough water this year. So cool. I can't wait. Yeah, my main mission today is to get some dog food up to uh, to pay dirt the pup a couple miles. After that, it should be a lot easier to hike because there's a pretty good amount of weight in that dog food. <laughs> Check it out, the blackberries are going to even start growing soon. That is pretty awesome. There's a big batch of it right here. I might need to make some wine this year. Some grape, fig, and blackberry wine. What do you think? What's up guys? On a serious note, we've been having a hell of a bad problem with people stealing stuff up here in the canyon. And if you are one of those people and happen to be watching my video, don't do it. Hey, what's up guys? I just realized this is my first trip by myself hiking. It's fun, but you know, it's not smart if you don't know the area, but definitely clearing my head out. <laughs> so my mission was a success. I got it up to her. Good girl. You guys ever want to donate food? Let me know. I'll bring it up. Man, I couldn't ask for a better day. It's perfect weather out. Just a little bit warm with a cool breeze. Nice. That's the old trail that's no longer. See, it just falls off the edge right there. Sage is blooming. The bees are out like crazy. That smells awesome. This is the four mile marker. <laughs> when the trail was here, it was probably a little more, a little more distance than that. An old structure. Way down there by the river. Yeah, not far from the bridge now. So I have a weird thought. If there was ever an end of the world situation, a zombie apocalypse or something, there's a spot right before the bridge. You'll probably find me here. It is ideal. It has everything you ever need. Surrounding coverage on every side. Wind is cut off over here. You got a lot of spots to grow vegetables over here in this little canyon on the side. I think it could survive, no problem. I can't even right next to that spot I was just showing you. So I really recommend coming up on Thursdays. Look at the size of that manzanita. That thing is probably 200 years old. Or older, probably, I don't know. But they, they do take a long time to grow. I'm here, I made it to the bridge. I'm looking up on that cliff face trying to find any mountain sheep to show you guys, but I'm not seeing any yet. They do blend in really good, so you just have to listen for like a rock fall and draw your attention that way. I'm here at the bridge. I just heard a voice somewhere, so I know somebody's about to show up. I love this place, man. I'm so glad that I did this trip today by myself. Right. 
Five, even though this is probably a lot farther. The power of water. It gets so much colder here, so much quicker here in the Narrows. I'm about to do some prospecting. Some gold in my uh, in my pan before I leave. Hopefully, I get a couple little pieces. I've always heard up here in the Narrows is you probably won't find a lot, but if you do find some, they'll probably be big pieces. But who knows if that's true or not? Wow, it looks like some really good spots to dig around here. All right, let me uh, let me attempt this. See this wall of water right here? This thing will just come down. Force unbelievably strong because of the narrow uh, hills between us. And those water comes flying down, all the way down. It takes this wall. See this wall? It takes a turn here. I don't know if you can tell that. Let me see. There's just a turn right there where this wall sticks out a little bit. Of course, there'll be some gold on the other side of that wall. But my belief right here is that this gold will come over here, do a spiral right around here, and end up like here. So I'm going to dig a little spot, do a few, uh, few scoops before I do a pan, but I think I'm going to find some gold right around there. At least I hope. Look at the size of this box. Got folded up in the river, but I think it could be a work done. Very cool. Check it out, little mini slides. Well, those wouldn't work, but that one looks like it'd be pretty fun to go in. Get a little dip into that pool. It only looks about like three feet, four feet deep. Yeah, I didn't get any luck on that other spot where I was digging. I'm gonna go walk to the sun over here and see if I can uh, find a spot down here. Yeah, it's starting to get a little cold and uh, yeah, it's only a matter of time before the sun's covering up all the, uh, or the mountain's covering up all the sun. <laughs> all right, guys. Not even much water, but it's just so much in focus into one little spot.
So Pharaoh, I think I found an alien gray out here. Maybe some other species. Man, this canyon is so nice. It's, a sh it's such a shame to see trash everywhere you go. Even trash from people you might even know. Well, I'm a poet now. I'm still here right now hanging out in the Narrows. The sun is just going over the, uh, the edge there. I don't think I'll make it to the to Devil's Gulch today, but I'll uh, see if I get some more footage when I get down there. Spent too much time panning around trying to find some with no luck, but what are you going to do? I have to spend a whole day just digging in one spot up here and I'll probably find some really good gold. Alright guys, well I got another structure here I've found. I don't know what it is. I'd have to walk over there and check it out, but I'm not looking forward to that. So I'll have to get a good look next time I'm here. It's next to a really old oak. At least 200, 300 year old oak. That's cool. But it was a foundation at one point for somebody's place. Wonder if it has a basement. Well, I did come over here after all. I can't quite make it up to the top. It's covered in uh, poison oak all the way around it. Still not quite sure what it is, but I'm sure it was some kind of dwelling. There's a little drain there. It's all concreted in, so yeah, I'm sure somebody lived here at some point. Good foundation. Here's a spring just on the side of the hill. I'm sure you could drink that water, but you know, it's pretty safe, or it's usually a good idea to filter it out. But in a pinch, it's a nice looking campsite over there. I might want to check out one of these days. See if I can see it even better from with this. It's like a nice shady spot. High enough that you wouldn't be super in danger if a big flood came through. Man, this plant looks like it's straight out of Dr. Seuss. Look at all those pine trees right up on the top of this hill. That's awesome. It goes down to this little cool, uh, where I believe is a spring. You can see all the moss growing right out of that hill. A couple more pine trees growing up the side. That's so cool. Man, I love this oak. I'm about at three and a half right now. At least three and a half miles to go back to the truck. All right, guys, made it out of the canyon. Beautiful hike today. Couldn't ask for a better day. Perfect weather. So nice. All right, guys, have yourself a good one. Catch you next time. Have a good day.